Animate for the Celevit Productions employs artists who create feature films and television shows in the traditional method of hand-drawn images. With 2D animation, you can make classical films. You can make amazingly, beautifully rich films. So it still marvels the eye of, of the old and the young to watch drawings come to life. It's an amazing art form. One of the things that distinguishes 2D hand-drawn animation from pretty much anything else is you have to have really strong pre-visualization skills. When you're sitting there flipping and rolling, it's moving at a different rate than it's going to move on the screen. And you're thinking, based on how many frames you have to pull this move off, am I going to be able to get away with abstractifying it? How much does it have to stretch across the screen? And I think you're just more organic as an artist. They give me the layout and uh, it shows me the positions of where things are going to stop and start. And animation is filling in all of those poses and making it go smoothly. This is a goat who's running towards a hole for reasons we yet do not know. See, there's a background that's been separated out. Now what my job is going to be is to create all of these poses that make smooth animation. Once he actually falls in the hole, that's that's when I start doing my little abstract thing. So if you slow it down and you're just looking at the different drawings, uh, not every one of them looks just like a goat. For example, look at all these legs, all these heads in a circle. But when you see it on the screen playing, it resolves into something recognizable, just the motion. You know, we're drawing motion here. And motion isn't always a very literal thing. This is sort of what makes animation different from still visual art.